Hi, so could you just tell us your name yeah. and which company? Yes, I'm Sandra Tavares and I'm the winemaker for my parents' estate in Tuchoka Pile in Lisbon wine region. And then in my, I have my own project with my husband, so it's Wine and Soul. And I'm also winemaker at Kindervaldo de Merida. Great. And you are quite well known, I think, as one of the Duro boys. <laughs> how, how do you feel about that marketing sort of angle? Is it still going strong? Yes, it's still very strong and it's a great example of what, what, uh, what uh, people getting together can manage to, to do. So do you um, exhibit together as a group or is it just a good sort of marketing yeah. way of um, sort of having the same kind of ethos? No, we, we always represent uh, together all the, the, the wines, uh, always as a group. So, and I think it helps a lot to, to show different visions of the uh, How important is the UK market to you with both your estates? I mean, how, how important are we? Um, yes, I think, I think UK market is really important as a critic mass, so it's, it's really important to be here and to, to, to be able to present our wines to this so vast. Uh, do, you, do you think we appreciate the more premium Portuguese wines yet? Do you think there's still mileage? No, I think the, the, you appreciate the premium top Portuguese wines. I think it's a pity that, for instance, the, the range, the medium range is still not re well represented. In yeah. in and do you think that needs big brands to do that or do you think it just needs more awareness? Uh, yes, more awareness because I think, uh, but of course, to have um, Good, good volumes. It has to be with the, the big companies, but I think it would be wonderful to be able to see with small companies as well and big companies. Yeah, and to show a lot the, the our potential, Portuguese yeah. potential. And for me, I certainly feel that the white Portuguese wines are certainly similar in a way to the Italian whites with their structure. That yes. They seem to have a lot of aromatic um, flavour. Do you, do you agree with that? Yes, I agree with that, and I think this is. Uh, we, uh, Portugal has a huge potential also with the whites and until now nobody is paying so much attention but I think as we have our own grape varieties like it Italian have them all so we have our own typicity yeah. uh, and our own diversity so I think it's we are very yeah. rich on the, in the white as well. And what about wine tourism? Do you feel that once people have been to Portugal and fall in love with the wines? Yes, I think so. I think yeah. so. I think it's a, it's a great, uh, it's the best way to understand Portuguese wine is yeah. going to Portugal and to see and also to compare and, and use it with Portuguese gastronomy. Yeah. And so it's, it's uh, I think it's a great experience. That's great. And your importer in the UK is, or your distributor? Yes, it's Corny and Barry. That's fantastic. Thank you so much. Thank you.